finally, I'll just ask you, what more really needs to be done at the policing level, at the ground level? Policing level has no choice but to be professional and not to fall a prey to any pressure at all because it's accountable to the court and no conviction can happen without solid evidence and evidence it can come only through good investigation. And now the new law mandates so much of forensic use that now it's becoming more um, uh, unbiased. It has to be scientific. So therefore, the policing, whatever it has to do manually, like recording the fire urgently. Number two, protecting the scene of crime. Three, bring in a forensic team right away at the earliest so that everything is scientific. Fourth, produce the uh, charge sheet, the case, as soon as possible. For, for, for going for a, a request for a fast track court and then apply the law for no adjournments. Keep it, that means the prosecution must keep it victim-centric. At the moment, so far, all our processes, by and large, have been accused-centric. A mm. judge is in, in favor, absence of the judge is in, in favor, non available mm. not, not having a fast-track court is in its favor, the appeal over an appeal is in its favor. Risk. Mm. So at the moment, who's speaking up for the victim? So the new laws is victim-centric, provided we implement this in letter and spirit. All right. Well, Dr. Kiran Bedi, thank you very much for joining us on the show.